Hey you guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to filter messages on your phone. A lot of people don't know that this feature actually exists um, and it's really helpful especially in this day and age where we all get a bunch of spam texts. I personally get about one to two spam messages every day and this feature is incredibly helpful to keep those spam texts in their separate folder um, just like your Gmail can do. Another reason this feature is really great um, is it can also filter unread messages for you as well. So if you're somebody who gets a lot of text messages every day, focusing on the ones that you need to respond to can make it a lot easier. This is incredibly easy to do. Um, it takes about 30 seconds. So to do this, you're going to launch your settings. And then we want to scroll down into our apps. And we're going to find the messages app and select it. And here is where we're going to find filter unknown senders here. Let me turn this on and we go back into our messages. What you're going to find are the filters option here on the left hand side. So when we select filters, we have five different options here. We have all messages, known senders, unknown senders, and unread messages. Um, and then beneath this, we have recently deleted as well. So this is going to make it really helpful for you to keep everything organized um, and keep everything in its own separate filter or folder. That way you can go through all of these unknowns here, sort through them and maybe delete them. And then you have all your unread messages here. Um, so if you had any, you could find them in this folder. One thing to make sure of, um, if this feature isn't popping up for you in your settings, you want to make sure that you have iOS 16 right now. If you don't have iOS iOS 16 um, and anything after that, this feature is not going to be available for you. You can also use this feature on your iPad or on your MacBook by following this, the exact same steps that I showed you. Alrighty, you guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that all this information was helpful and I will see you guys in the next video.